Good morning, friends. Today we'll cover chapter three, in which we will cre- create our first program on Spark RDD. So let's go to with the theory first. That every Spark application consists of a driver program. This driver program is running on the on the master node, that runs the user's main function or the main program, uh, and executes various parallel operations on a cluster. Spark provides RDD, which is a collection of elements partitioned across. the nodes of the cluster that can be operated on in parallel so what we mean is that if you look at this diagram which is our the whole architecture uh, at a very high level that we have got this driver program on the, on the master node or the main node where we are running our main method in java in that we have to first of all create a spark context now not this spark context object is the is the gateway for uh, all the spark functionalities this is the main context that will take care of talking to the cluster manager talking to all the worker nodes and storing all the program context it's very much similar to the database connection that we use if we go into more details uh, as we discussed in the theoretical part of this uh, of this video that uh, we get a doubt our driver program then we have to first think is that we have to create the spark context and after that we have to create those rdds that is the other data structures for further actions uh, or transformations so this actually actually in our uh, java api it's this java spark context so this java spark context is the one we are talking about that we have to create so if you go through this uh, details that a java friendly version of spark context that returns java rdds and works with java collections instead of scala ones so this is actually same similar to the spark context this spark context is more related to scala Uh, and so the Java version of it is that we have to create this Java Spark context. And one important thing to note here is that only one Spark context should be active for JVM. So if we have got one main program, so that is one application, and that should be associated with only one Spark context. And we must always stop the active sp- uh, Spark context before creating a new one. So we'll go through this and we'll create this Spark context, and we can see the different parameters we can pass. Pass a Spark configuration, for example. Uh, we can use the Scala uh, Spark context and all. And there are various other uh, constructor parameters by which we can create this Java Spark context. As we know that the Spark context has been available since Spark 1.x versions, and it's an entry point to Spark when we want to program and use Spark RDD. Most of the open methods or functions we use in Spark comes from Spark context. For example, accumulators, broadcast variables, parallelize, and more. But going from Spark uh, 2.0 for the latest versions, we we uh, we should use Spark session because Spark session has become an entry point to Spark to work with RDD, data frame, and data set. Prior to 2.0, it was Spark context, right? But now I think going forward, because we are using the Spark version of 3.3.1, uh, which is uh, so we should always use Spark session and. One Spark, uh, there there can be multiple Spark sessions uh, for the same JVM. So it has it has not got the same restrictions as Spark context that it should be only like one context per JVM. Spark session can be many under the same context or the same uh, main driver program. We can create as many Spark session as we want in a Spark application using either Spark session dot builder or Spark session dot new session. I created this. Uh, The Java Docs API here it's mentioned the same thing that uh, this is the way we can create a Spark session or we can use an ex- existing Spark session to create a new using the new new session uh, method. So here we will see that there are like various configurations that we are passing, which we'll discuss now when we create our first program. So I'm in my intelligent now. Let's start creating our first program.